what's going on everybody what you see behind me is all these packages I've been ordering they're finally starting to come in all the stuff that was on back order or that they canceled my order on that I had to resubmit orders and they changed the price well they're finally coming in so you know what that means upgrades for Zeus For those of you that have been following the channel, you already know I wasn't a fan of any of the stock Corvette wheels, but I tried to get an upgraded set, hoping the Trident wheels in person would be something I could grow to love and embrace on my car. But it didn't work, so I decided to replace the wheels and give Zeus my own personal touch and its unique look to stand out from the rest. I wanted something that still maintained a sporty appearance, but also added a luxury appeal that would make the unique color of my C8 give the vibe of a luxury roadster as well. I wanted the design and color scheme of my wheels to not scream sports car, but to embrace the minute and design, giving it supercar styling, which I feel emphasizes the dual role my car's unique color plays and bring it to life. So let's take a look at what I came up with. So what do you think? I worked closely with Chet, the owner of Arioli Wheels, to create my own custom wheels that could deliver everything I desired. I knew I wanted a more tight spoke design. It's a look I fell in love with many years back when I owned a 2006 Dodge Charger and carried it over to several vehicles I've owned after, like my Range Rover and convertible 6 Series BMW. I always felt like that look coexisted well with the luxury aspect of all the cars I've owned, but it still brought an aggressive sports feel to the cars that wasn't quite over the top. Although this design may seem simple and timeless, we worked on it for several months before we brought it to life. I guess the hardest decision was the color. I went back and forth so many times between black chrome, a bright bronze, rose gold, typical chrome, gloss black, which I really wanted to get away from, and something that could offer a different color shading depending on the lighting angle just like my car. After weeks of going back and forth with myself, I decided on these. Hopefully it does the trick. Let's go put them on a the car. What's going on everybody? So we out here rolling to the, get these uh, wheels installed on the car so I can show you guys what they look like. So like I said, Zeus got some upgrades coming. Um, I won't be able to get all of them installed in this video, but they definitely come in quickly. So stay tuned. But right now we heading out to get the wheels installed so I can put them on there and give you some shots of the new look of wheels on Zeus. So. What's going on, ICMV Drivers Edition community? If you haven't already done it, please hit the like button. But I also understand if you want to see more of the video before you give it your stamp of approval. If you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. Click the subscribe button to join the ICMV Drivers Edition community. And also so you can get notifications when I release more videos and content that you may like.
All right, everybody, I'm heading over to Tires on Us to see if I can get the wheels mounted on. Um, a lot of people, if you've been watching the video so far, you know I'm about to get, I got some wheels, I got some other stuff. I'm heading to get the wheels mounted on so we can see how that turns out. So uh, people at Tires on Us are pretty much taking care of me, so I can't complain, so I go back and return the favor. So shout out to Tires on Us for taking care of me. I appreciate all y'all help. It's a little rainy out here, but we're getting the wheels put on. So let's take a look at what we've seen. Well, as you see, it's definitely a different change. I didn't think it would be that great, but it works out. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Do you like the look? Do you feel like it's over the top? Do you feel like it's too much? Give me your insight. I would love to hear it. So we're driving back, we're getting the wheels put on. It definitely is a different feel, but the car feels a little bit lighter, which is kind of crazy. You can actually notice the difference in the wheels. Um, I put some Pirellis on them. I wrapped it in Pirellis, right? P-Zeros. A lot of people say I wouldn't like them. Honestly, the ride seems smooth. You know, I had, I had Pirellis before on a Beamer I had. I felt like going with Pirellis would be a good thing. So I got, I got a lot of comments saying oh, you ain't gonna like them P-Zeros, but I'm out here in the wet weather. And, you know, if I punch it out, I slip a little bit, but they, they hug the road pretty well, so I can't complain about it. So, um, before we get rid of this video, I'm going to give you a little bit more shots of me. Well, I'm going to give you a couple more shots of walking around the car, let you see the wheels and so forth, so you can get to enjoy the stands. Again, shout out to uh, Erlarly Wheels, my custom ICMBDE wheels. 
This was a long time in the works. We went back and forth for months on this project and designing this wheel and so forth, something I wanted that was slightly different from what he already had. So if you like the wheels, get yourself for your vet, the ICMB driver's edition version. So stay tuned. I hope you like it. Yes, I will admit it could have been a tad bit darker. Maybe I should have went with bronze, but that was just one of those things. I, it was hard for me to commit. And I know some people are like, oh, well, bronze would have set it off. You're probably 100% right. And don't, don't count me out. I may redo something. And I may grab some bronzes later on down the line, you know. I, I ain't done playing with it yet, but... Everybody, thank you for watching the video. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe, join the ICM and Drivers Edition community. Nothing but love here and creativity and people, you know, we messed around with our cars and making them to be more customized to us. So if you down with that lifestyle, you just want to sit back and watch or want to see the creative juices that we all have, join the community, share your vehicle. If you want to put your vehicle on the channel, reach out to me. I travel a lot. You'll be surprised where I'm at. Matter of fact, I was talking with somebody and they were saying I should do an ICM driver's edition and document my travels. So I may be doing that too, letting you know when I'm coming near a city near you because I'm out everywhere. I know you guys don't know that, but I be everywhere. So uh, you want to feature your vehicle on the channel, hit me up. We'll try to make it happen. But other than that, I'll see you in these streets. Thanks for tuning in. Stay blessed. Stay creative. Peace.